We are just about an hour from sunset and the start of Ramadan. As the faithful prepare for the holiest month, CBS 2's Chris Ty tells us what Chicago area Muslims will be focusing on this year. Ramadan is, is a time for self-reflection. Uh, it's a time when we try to empty our bodies from the materialistic uh, uh, items uh, to fill it with uh, spirit. What will also be full for the first time in three years, places of worship like here at the Mecca Center in Willowbrook, where they expect members of the local Muslim community shoulder to shoulder over the next 29 days and nights a site COVID has taken from them since 2019. We should not take it for granted because uh, anything could happen, God forbid, and so we should take advantage of today. We, we should take advantage of this year. Hia Moinadeen is preparing meals for the month ahead, where fasting and breaking the fast are part of the daily routine. It's a time of really um, some really great deep spiritual rejuvenation um, where we really think about um, how, what are the areas in which we can improve ourselves. Like, you know, we'll Part of that improvement is a program she's lead therapist for. Project Takwa helps those of her faith deal with the often stigmatized problems around mental health. How complex it can be for people that struggle with their mental health to really, um, especially during this month, kind of focus on these areas of how do I get better as a person? How do I deepen my connection with God? The first fast of Ramadan begins Thursday at sunrise, but the focus really this year will be more on gratitude than in past years, given that so many in their faith community are suffering half a world away. This year might be unique in light of some recent events that have occurred, especially in regards to um, earthquakes and other catastrophes that have occurred globally in our um, communities. Over 45,000 died from these quakes in Turkey and Syria, many of them Muslim, and all being remembered during the holiest month of this calendar year. Entering Ramadan with this mindset of kind of amplified gratitude, of just being um, grateful that we are here. In Willowbrook, Chris Ty, CBS 2 News. To learn more about the mental health program being offered to those in the Muslim community, we have a link to Project Taqwa on our website, cbschicago.com.